Hi, Patricia. I'm going to do your 15-minute healing now. So we're going to focus on some things here. Um, you've said it's been a rough road of chronic health problems and emotional pain. You really need the energy healing for chronic fatigue, FMS, so fibromyalgia syndrome, and then depression and feelings of unworthiness from major childhood verbal abuse. So major dysfunctional stuff. Okay. You have some positive stuff in here that you wrote um, about twin souls and you feel like your life is finally beginning. You're 60 years old. That's really cool. <laughs> we need to all feel like our lives are beginning, <laughs> filling with lots of joy, <laughs> no matter what age you are. So I'm going to just relax and then we'll see what happens, okay? So I'm so seeing a color and it's really interesting. First it's like a lilac color but it's starting to become alive and glowing and it's a living purple color. It's really unique. I don't see it come alive like this. So I'm just examining it and waiting for the next thing. There's something associated with this. I don't have a clue what that splash is. It's white and has black spots. And it's sort of like a smush next to the living lilac color. I'm just going to close my eyes and we'll focus. They're showing me shapes and the shapes are developing. The purple color is in a sphere and this odd smush is kind of surrounding it white and black with black spots like a Dalmatian dog and then it's growing it's kind of growing um, it's like halfway around and it's kind of smushy it's not perfect or anything and it's sort of wanting to touch the other side the other side is perfectly white over here so I'm watching this so this has it's really weird but it's as if they're trying to reflect through shapes and color, what your experience is. <laughs> but it's interesting because as I'm watching this develop, it's like it's a sun in the universe, but it's also like a pendant on a necklace, and it's also like a reflection of your dynamic soul, and it's all, it has too many reflective meanings to me. So I'm just continuing, and it's growing bigger and bigger and getting more solid, more circular, more impressive in its shape and size and how clear it's becoming. So I'm just watching it here. I don't know what to make of it. I tell my spirit guys, I don't know what to make of this. They're showing me it's spinning now. They're spinning it like this. They're saying that we're healing you, so I'm just going with it. We're releasing these black spots from the white. There's some sort of version of Ill illness. So it's just spinning, and then the black spots are being released. It has a way of spinning one way, and then it gets, it's like it's on a chain or something. And so it spins until the chain gets, like, like you're on the swing, and you spin, and then you let the spin go back the other way, you know? So it just kind of goes one way, and then, and then it goes the other way. If something feels like it needs to just choose the direction of its spin, it just needs to stay in that direction without stopping, but I'm examining spinning it, and, and not letting it, go back the other way. I'm just examining it and trying different things with it to see what feels good. The spots are definitely not there. It's getting wider around the purple and it's getting, it looks better. <laughs> it's not like a smush of color that's not quite perfect, perfectly circle circular it's like a little kid trying to draw a circle and it's that it's not circular <laughs> you know it's kind of out there so it's a smush over here well this side it looks good so we need to balance both sides this is very important for you we're balancing both sides the white is is contemplating it's this is interesting. I'll just tell you the white is contemplating its 
balance with the other side because it needs to alter. It's not quite altered yet. It's kind of like snow and then this is really smooth. And then this thing is spinning so fast that I can't even see it spinning at all. And it won't stop. It's just, I mean, it's spinning so fast that I can't even see that it is spinning. But yet, it's clearly that they're helping me to know that that is what's going on. <laughs> Have you ever seen something spin so fast that you can't even tell that it's spinning? That's what they're saying. So it becomes motionless. It spins so fast that it actually doesn't look like it's moving at all. And this is important. I'm asking them for help um, with this white part. They're creating energy to help move this white and sort of move it around so that it's smooth and in alignment with the other side it's balanced there's a golden light that they're pushing it with and it just goes in a circle around and it's smoothing it out on all sides it looks really good there's a perfect sort of separation between the white now and the purple and it's amazing this looks amazing to me. Uh, it's almost making me dizzy. <laughs> sort of like we're um, putting paint on something that's spinning really fast and then it's moving the paint around. They're showing me that picture too. It's honestly overwhelming. I'm telling them I, I'm, get, I'm getting dizzy from this. <laughs> See, they're telling me not to focus on the spin, just see it as a flat picture then. <laughs> I'm trying very hard. Say, allow the colors now to move as they're inspired. They create a beautiful picture that is balanced by as inspired. And this, it just, it's like, it's not paint spreading, it is light spreading. It is light that is inspired to move, like kind of paint moves on a circular thing, you know, it just moves outward. But light now is moving outward from the white line, from the white ring, and then this purple sphere is moving light as well. So it's blending all this light, it's getting brighter, it's really pretty. There's something releasing. I don't, it's, so, I'm in the universe looking at this, okay? It's about the oddest um, healing they've ever done with me. Um, there's something that just blasted out from the background, the black universe background. It just blasted out just some sort of black ball that was kind of jammed in there. It's almost like I'm seeing you as a human being, but I'm seeing you in conjunction with the universe and this star reflection that looks so much better now and this whatever this black thing was it came out of some part of your physical body of some part of your your humanist reflection that needed to go it's like old energy it just it like out of the heart portal area but it seemed a little bit lower than that i'm just that was a big deal that that came out the more your light gets brighter it just instantly releases everything else that isn't Create that isn't part of the reflection. They're, they're really wanting to help push out all of this other negative congestion that's been back there for too long. It's just more of these. It's interesting because we got rid of the black dots from the white thing, but what comes out of whatever this dark space is, it's, it's associated with your body, is like little black spheres. And they're just all shooting out like cannons. <laughs> And there's one after the other after the other. They're like black pearls or something. But they're not smooth at all. They're kind of... They're more... I don't know. They're not smooth, though. Feels good to get those out. It feels... Um, the energy work that I'm experiencing is really unique. And it makes me feel... 
one way and then the other and then the spinning you know because <laughs> it does I get motion sickness really easily so it's like whoa I'm feeling a little bit wild right now <laughs> and they're telling me that it it's part of my own thing so we're just gonna keep getting this out of you <laughs> Okay, so there's something new they're doing here. We're moving you up an elevator. You're in an elevator. And we're going upward with you really high. And as we go high, some other things are going down as you are going up simultaneously. It's really interesting. It's a weird image. So it's like I see things going down while you're go simultaneously going up. So it's like there's a picture of up and down going to go at the same time. But you are part of the going up and whatever else. I don't... It's weird. <laughs> this is strange. They're talking about the perception of going up or down. Like you could just be in the same spot. Although we're creating the illusion of you going upwards. <laughs> they're doing this sort of... They're, per you know, they do these perception things. Um... Because it, they try to help us understand the infinite spiritual universe. We try, we start feeling like we're individuals, you know, and, and things are separate and everything is in oneness. So how do you go up in vibration? Do you actually go upward or do you just allow yourself to move up in vibration without going anywhere at all? And Cryon kind of talks about that in a soul rebirth journey that I did. And it was number 14, I think about raising your vibration by not going anywhere at all. So that's what we're doing. We're raising your vibration while you're simultaneously just standing in the same place. It helps me feel really awesome as well. The more that I experience this elevator thingy, I f the better I balanced I feel and the better I the just I feel so much just I feel right. I feel right inside. And there's getting this this structure cleared out seeing all the spinning is part of the healing so it kind of jo jolts me but I feel it uh, effectively working so I'm just allowing myself to continue watching move upward they want me to indicate very specifically we are raising your vibration <laughs> we are purging what is no longer needed and related to energy, energy that creates, energy that is defined as your reflection in this physical incarnation, which is merely energy all along. So we're helping release energy that is not appropriate for the energy that is you <laughs> in the now. <laughs> I don't know the language to define this. <laughs> This is important because I see a mirage of what is an older version of you, of your reflection, and it's being released from the back outward. You are ready to take the journey up in vibration. You, This is really welcomed, and you're really welcoming the release of old energy. You're really welcoming it. You're very much so ready for this. And you're welcoming more release of old. So we're doing that for you. Your heart is very excited about this experience. And is really... It's that influences me to do so much more. And the heart is just so ready for this. It's so ready to let go of everything that was. And that really says a lot about why you're feeling like you're you're you know waking up for the first time you're six years old and life has just begun really I can feel that I can experience that in your heart that really shows how it's really easy to pull out the old because it's not you're you've left it behind already but we're just helping get the, some of this out of there too so we can really release really help you with all these other symptoms you're dealing with so, but you're um, doing everything right. I mean, all I get is thumbs up, thumbs up. Like, I'm trying to find the language to define. Yay, she's awesome. She's in it. She's like so, so good. 
um, positive, positive awesomeness going on here. <laughs> it's really fun to, I'm still working on pulling out old energy from straight out behind, and it's like really easy to do, keep pulling it out. So your passion, your motivation, your excitement, it just influences this work so much more. And we're showing there's there this in, structure, right? It, with the light is just getting so much brighter. And I'm going to work with heaven and really bring out the light and really bring out the light that pushes out all the old that is no longer a part of who and what you are. So... Is really beautiful thing that happened. I know we're running out of time, so I'll just describe. So it's really praying in your spiritual atmosphere and working with heavens directly is so effective. And so I work with heaven in order to make your light so much brighter. And so I pray for you, right? I pray for heaven to share so much love with you, so much light, so much energy to really bring out the brightness of your star and to help you let go of all the old, right? Because you are letting go of all the old. You already are letting go of all the old. So we're just going to keep letting go of it and healing it and make you just feel awesome, okay? And so as I do this, they're showing me this image with the structure getting bright. And then they show me you and the elevator and the reflection of staying in place. They let it go so we could, what I could relate as a human being now to it helps me to seeing you just going upward and it's like going up to heaven right and so as you go up the elevator there's a star up here and then it's just the elevator takes you right up and then your body merges with the star which is also this shape as well so your reflection is entirely in oneness with this immaculate image of this purple and the living purple and the living white and it's beautiful it's absolutely gorgeous star and so you are in oneness with the light the light that comes from love love then creates the light that is you and so that is where we're at <laughs> okay all right patricia thank you for this amazing experience it's totally unique um we don't they don't usually show me that version of healing and so it's pretty special and different and um, I'll be curious to see how you're feeling as the days pass. So thank you for um, connecting with me and exploring this work with me. I'm definitely wishing you all the best. So those of you in the audience, if you'd like to experience spiritual healing with me, you may do so by visiting my website at abbynormalswisdomquest.com. Thank you for watching.